Now we don't traditionally eat hay, but you know what? We sure do reap the benefits from good hay. Matter of fact, what I have here is some bread topped with butter from a grass-fed cow. And then over here, I've got butter from a grain-fed cow. And what I'm about to do is I'm gonna go out and see if people can taste the difference between the grass-fed butter and the grain-fed butter. You like butter? Love it. What do you guys like to put butter on? Uh, popcorn. Popcorn? Toast. Yeah. Toast? Pretty much anything. <laughs> I have two types of butter that I'd like you to try. One is from a grass-fed cow. The other is from a grain-fed cow. I just want you to try them and tell me if you see if there's a difference and okay. maybe what you like better. Okay, there's one. Good, yeah. It's really creamy. Light, light okay. creamy, yeah. So now let's try butter beet. I would say that's a little bit sharper. What about you? It's good. <laughs> I, I can't really judge butter though. <laughs> this one has a little sweeter taste than that does. Butter A was made with butter from cows that only ate grass. Mm -hmm. B is the grain fed. There you go. So they're both real butter though. They're right? both real butter. Just grass fed and grain fed. Do you like them both, right? Mm -hmm. yeah, Could you both. tell a significant difference between the two? Not really. A little bit, but not. A little bit, not, not much. Yeah. yeah, not bad. I was looking for a difference, but if I wasn't looking for a difference, they'd, they'd both be fine.